dropped into Charles Austin Pumps. Now, I want to take the opportunity to review their Sodic machine here. It's not brand new, it's been going four years, but A, it looks immaculate, and B, you're a big fan? Yes, very big fan. It's a very good machine. Why do you say that's a big statement, though? Why do you, why do you say it's a good machine? Oh, because uh, the quality of work that it outputs to me yeah. when I've put a job on there and filled out all the information. Okay. When you say quality of work in terms of speed, accuracy, yeah, working overnight? Accuracy, it, if, I'm, if I want it to do this, it'll do it. So when you're saying that then, what sort of, any, any material, well, any sparking material? Yeah, so we can spark like alley, we can spark um, steel, we can use uh, copper electrodes, graphite electrodes. Right, okay. So this gives you that flexibility on that yeah, side of things? And, and uh, I know that Sodic said that if there's exotic materials as well, they can help us with that, they can produce special code for that. And okay. Now, you mentioned Sodic there, as, as we said, the machine is actually four years old, but still going very strong, as you'd expect. How have they been in terms of support? They're very good. We've had like a small issue in the past, uh, and they were out on it straight away and fixed it within warranty. So it was, yeah, it was really good. What about applications, the guys? Are they, do you need to call them occasionally? Uh, we have done in the past, yeah. yeah, when we've had issues, when we forgot to turn the key. <laughs> the basics then? Yeah, the very <laughs> basics, yeah. But no, they've been very good. They're right straight on it. Sometimes we'll send them a file again. Um, and they review our program and tell us if we have any issues. But to yeah. be honest, with the four years, it's, we've, we've got quite efficient at it now. It's it's helped us out loads. Absolutely. Now, in terms of the actual program, you've got the screen behind us. That's a touch screen. But what are you actually do, doing with that screen? Everything required? Uh, yeah, so full programming on that machine, uh, entering in your positions of what you want to spark, your area of your electrode how deep you're going to go, uh, how many times you're going to, how many parts you're going to make, yeah. and, and all of that. But also power in, in terms of sparking and the length, length of spark and things like that, and finish. And that all works it out itself uh, on the stuff that you input into. Right, okay. But all easy to use, all very intuitive. Yeah, very, yeah, very you follow the, the process, it kind of guides you a bit. Okay. No. Now, also, with this machine, linear motor drive? Yes. What does that mean to... Uh, smoothness yeah. basically in the drives uh, just no issues with uh, it always going to the positions that you want never have any like backlash or anything like that so okay. now what sort of parts are you actually making on this so we make uh, e main inserts for injection mold tools right. now very complex parts I'm assuming uh, yes yeah. depending on the product that we're making the mold for but yes yeah, that's it. nice very and simple yeah uh, yes but with this machine not a problem no, not an issue at all. It's a very good machine. Yeah. Like I said, the, the quality of work that we get out of it is excellent. excellent. Well, that's it. Just a quick overview of this Sodic machine, the EDM machine. Thank you very much.